season four review of the simpsons so if you have not seen my season one two and three and simpsons movie review they're up now uh they've been up on youtube so i'm up I've been going through every single season at my own pace of The Simpsons to eventually review every single season ever made of The Simpsons. I'm crazy to be doing that, but I want to, and mostly because a lot of these episodes I haven't seen, and also a lot of people say the new episodes are bad, but maybe there's some hidden gems. I don't know. I wasn't there to experience this stuff, so now I'm experiencing some of it again and some of it now um so it's just fun to do this and i am uh, am enjoying it so far the first season i didn't uh, i thought was pretty slow it was very there was not that many episodes so that helped but the animation was kind of garbage some of the characters didn't act like they, they did later in the show and it wasn't all that funny, and it was just kind of boring. Some episodes were kind of just depressing, like Homer's Odyssey, which I thought was a good episode, but it was just depressing. Um, I, season 2 got better, but there were still, like, a lot of episodes that were just kind of like, eh, it's okay. And I, it, 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 that was the main thing there. I mean, it did introduce Trials of Horror and some characters I really like. And expand upon other characters that I also really like. So, I enjoyed that part of the season too. But it still was not... Still was not a season that I was really... Man, that's that's really uh, amazing. 10 out of 10. Um, yeah, I, I mean, I liked it and all. But, you know, it's just... Then season 3 I, it was, like, getting pretty funny. Like, it was funny stuff, but I wasn't laughing too hard. Like, there were episodes that I'd probably laugh at, like, one gag and be like, <laughs> that's hilarious. And I'd literally laugh out loud. Some of the other... Uh, season 1 and 2, it's not that they didn't have laughs. They were just kind of more of chuckles. And season 3 had more chuckles than actual laughs. But, um... But season 4 is freaking hilarious. There are so many episodes, like, just entire episodes. I was just laughing the whole way through. It just, I laughed so hard through majorities of these. Um, th like, there's this one gag where Homer just... He, he, Homer... Uh, it's the episode where it's introduced that uh, Ralph is Chief, Chief Wiggum's son. I think, that's his, I think that was the second episode he was in. I don't know exactly, but I didn't keep track. But, um, that's, that, there's a joke where, to get revenge, because Lisa broke up with Ralph in the episode, Chief Wiggum smashes one of Homer's headlights, and Homer says, you know, one day, the, the people of this town are going to stand up to you crooked cops, and then he just goes, they have, they are? Uh, they said a day? <laughs> it was just like, it's, it's, it was just hilarious. I laughed so freaking hard. There was other gags that I was just laughing at. I don't really want to spoil any of these, honestly. They're really smart, genius gags. And they're, they're just some really good episodes overall. An episode, a lot of the episodes, I would say more than half of the episodes are 10 out of 10 episodes, honestly. These are really funny, good episodes. I think there was like a couple episodes I didn't like really, but I couldn't even really remember them because they're just kind of like, eh. It's not really like, man, that's terrible. No, it's just like, eh, it was okay. I could watch it again. I just wouldn't care too much about doing it. Like, I wouldn't go, man, I'm going to rewatch that episode. And then uh, season five, um, you know, it's what I'm looking forward to getting to. But I liked how this season expanded upon so many of the characters. Like, like I said, they they introduced, they gave Ralph, uh, Chief Wiggum's son, uh, his own episode, and uh, Chief Wig and the police get more characterization. Uh, Pooh gets more characterization and things like that. It's it's just really nice to see all these characters, and it makes the world feel more fleshed out. With each season, they kind of ex explore more of the characters, show more sides of them, and, um, I even think Patty had an episode 
a couple episodes in this season that were actually legitimately good. Um, so, I, and I don't care for those Selma and Patty, honestly, I hate them. Uh, but they had actually legitimately good episodes and some funny lines and stuff. So I was enjoying this season. I enjoyed what they were doing. And I think, um, I think this is probably my favorite, this is my favorite season so far. Uh, kind of, I'm kind of really excited to watch season five. Um, but yeah, I, I'm not, I'm, I'm kind of scared what happens after season nine because that's, when people say, oh, the Golden Gage is over, so does it get really bad? Does it just get bad? Does it... I don't know. It, so, you know... Who knows? I am interested to see what happens, but I really liked this season. I think this is one of my favorite seasons of the show. If you notice, I've kind of not been too enthusiastic when I was reviewing the Simpsons seasons. It's not that I'm like, eh, I don't want to. Is I do. It's just that they haven't really caught me and like, wow, this is good. I because I know I'm supposed to be laughing because this show is a comedy. I haven't been laughing and it's kind of been just meh. And but it's actually gotten pretty good. Um, so I've I've enjoyed this season overall, and I like that the writers got more and more self aware as the show's been going on. Especially in this season, there was some actual, like, fourth wall breaks and interesting things that were really done well. Honestly, I love this season. So, yeah, that's this season. I don't know why I have this, but I do. I don't know why. I do. I do have this, though. <laughs>